as we're figuring out what ads to show, the the we have systems that predict click-through rate on ads so that we're sure that we're ranking them appropriately relative mm -hmm. to what users are going to find as, mm -hmm. as relevant. Mm -hmm. And similar systems power um, our news feed. Mm -hmm. You know, using click-through rate as right. a as a indication of interest by our mm -hmm. users, making sure that uh, what we build is is, mm -hmm. is as engaging as possible to the end user. Interesting. And one of our one of our challenges, I think, is making sure that businesses understand how much value can come from the friendships mm -hmm. forged at work that are made stronger by the use of Facebook, and also with features like groups. Um, and, and being able to have these conversations in shared private spaces mm -hmm. that there's an enormous amount of value to um, companies in leveraging Facebook for their, their folks. Mm -hmm. Imagine a barista at a Starbucks mm -hmm. um, who uh, is, is gonna, um, isn't feeling well and, and needs to find a replacement for mm -hmm. themselves. If there was a group of all the uh, part-time baristas for that Starbucks restaurant mm -hmm. or even a mm -hmm. couple of the Starbucks sites mm -hmm. around Seattle, we all know that there yeah. are many of them, there are. Um, uh, then, and that person could say, hey, not it would post a message to that group, right. to all the baristas saying, hey, right. not feeling great this morning, anybody want to take my shift? Right. That's way more efficient than right. what I can only imagine these folks do today, yeah, which is sure. maybe at best a person calling in that they're going to be sick and then a manager right. scrambling to find a replacement. Right. So Facebook almost comes to replace an intranet of an, of an organization, Absolutely. An organ and, the social interaction part of their intranet. Absolutely. And Facebook itself, we are really dog-fooding the beginnings of mm -hmm. mammoth uh, in, uh, intranet capabilities of the site. So. Yeah. Every team here has a Facebook group that we do a lot of our interactions on, and it's, uh -huh. it's really started to replace mailing lists as a primary form of interaction. Right. Our mission here really is trying to represent a lot of the, the, uh, the connections between objects in the real world and trying to make sure that each object in the real world has exactly one object on Facebook mm -hmm. so that as you um, interact with the Internet mm -hmm. um, and, and the world at large, um, you can do so as yourself through Facebook and through Facebook's partners um, in a way that kind of is very aware of who you are so that everything that we do for you is more relevant to who you are and more meaningful to you because it's done in the context of your social circle. And, then, and of course, now that you can use Facebook login in so many other places, I think that really even underscores the idea that Facebook is the place yeah. and then all these other places are sort of surrounding the Facebook identity. Yeah, and those those partners are really, really important to us because if we can't add value through that mechanism, then the users aren't going to aren't going to care about that identity in the same way as if they can use that identity mm -hmm. for everything that they do online. Mm -hmm. So it's 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 a really important part of the value we're trying to create in the world is making sure that everybody has good access to that social graph mm -hmm. and is able to make good use of it to make their products better, to make their experiences mm -hmm. better more socially relevant to their users. When you're looking at movies, you don't care as much about what some random people thought about the quality of the movie. You care about what your friends thought about the quality right. of the movie. Right. And being able to make that platform capability available to those companies is a, is a real game changer for every, every uh, area of industry yeah. that um, has tried. Yeah, interesting. So coming back to the idea before that, that the, the core thing that as at the center of Facebook is people and their social networks. Mm -hmm. And their social networks are a great indicator of a lot of other things. For example, what might you like, do, what might you like to do tonight? Mm -hmm. Your social network can really help you with that. What movie might you like to see? Your social network can have, what, what might you like to buy? Your social network can help you figure that out. That's right, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So it's the social network really at the center of the, of the, the information puzzle 